What's up guys? We have a giveaway going on for the Air Jordan 1 Shadow 2.0 that ends tomorrow. I'm giving away this pair, brand new size 9.5 for completely free. All you guys need to do to enter this giveaway is be sure to hit that thumbs up, leave a comment down below, subscribe to the channel, give me a follow on Instagram, and then DM me proof that you did everything. I'll be picking the winner tomorrow, June 5th. For the shadow air jordan 1 2.0 after the shadow 2.0 giveaway is over so in a few days from now i want to announce a brand new air jordan 1 giveaway and that air jordan is in my hands right now there's a little sneak peek so i need you guys to hit that thumbs up get this video up to 300 likes for this new air jordan 1 giveaway hitting that thumbs up really does help the channel grow so please guys hit that thumbs up be sure to subscribe if you guys love sneakers which i know you do so subscribe hit that subscribe button join the more family and let's jump into this jordan 1 video today in this video we're gonna take a look at a pair of air jordan ones that you should not hold quick flip these air jordan ones to be honest i hope you already sold them because this jordan one dropped in price a little bit more after its release this is not a sneaker that is worth holding jordan ones for the most part usually go up in price right but you have to determine and think are they worth holding is it worth the time that is going to take for it to go up in price sometimes yes and sometimes no today we're going to take a look at a pair of jordan ones that was not a hold this jordan one is not a hold whatsoever be sure to quick flip them if you haven't already go ahead and let them go they will go up in price it will happen but it's not worth your time it is not worth the investment please leave a comment let me know if you guys like the vlog style or if you like when i just put the camera down and sit like this and film please leave a comment down below let me know in this video i'm gonna do a little bit of both we'll do some holding the camera action and then in a little bit i'll put the camera down and we'll talk more about these jordan ones jordan ones for the most part are really good holds they all go up in price every jordan one one day will pretty much go up in price but sometimes they're not worth holding. Sometimes they take way, way too long to go up in price. And I'm talking years to go up $100, $200. Not worth your time. Not worth the investment. So I hope you guys quick flip this Air Jordan 1 already. If you haven't, be sure to let them go. Go take the money and invest in another pair of Air Jordan 1s. If this is a must cop for you, go ahead and cop them because you can get this Jordan 1 for a few dollars more than retail plus tax plus shipping. It's about it. Not much profit to be made on this Jordan 1. But they will eventually go up in price. But like I keep saying, guys, this Jordan 1 was not a hold. Don't hold these Jordan 1s, please. Let them go, quick flip them while you can, and go make your little bit of profit, your lunch money, and take the money, put it into another Jordan 1. I promise you, it will be worth your time and investment putting this money into another pair of Jordan 1s. For example, the University Blues, the Hyper Royals. There's other Jordan 1s you can invest in. This is not the Jordan 1 you want to invest in and hold right now. You watching this video, if you love Air Jordan 1s, be sure to hit that like button, bro. Smash that like button down below. Also, be sure to subscribe to the channel. I love my Jordan 1s, and I know you do too. So be sure to join the more family. Hit that subscribe button. Let's open these up. Let's take a look at this Jordan 1 that is not, not a hold. This Jordan 1 was a quick flip, quick flip only. Take your profits, move on to the next release, or go ahead and invest in other Jordan 1s. So let's open these up, man really dope shoe i like them but like i said guys just not a hold prices are too low which means they can only go up from this point forward right that's true however this jordan one's gonna take too long way too long in my opinion two three four years years for this jordan one to go up in price guys sell them sell them sell them don't hold this jordan one please do not hold them let them go please the patinas guys do not hold them sell them sell them sell them they are a dope sneaker i think the colorway is really nice i like them personally i think they're very clean they're very wearable not a good hold 
not a good hold. They were selling for around 230, 240. They've dropped to around like 200 bucks on stock X. Retail 170, plus tax, shipping, you're basically gonna wind up breaking even, if not losing a few dollars if you sell them on stock X. Your best bet is to sell them locally, try to get 190, 200 bucks out of them, and move on to the next release. If short and one is cool, they're just not a good hold whatsoever. I like the effect how you have, you know, a olive type color. It's almost olive gray in between mix. And then it fades into like the bronze effect. That's why you, they're called the patina right here. I like that effect. I do not like the tongue. I wish we had the regular Nike Air tongue. I think a lot of people are not really fans of this sneaker because of the effect and that Nike Air. I think it's as simple as that. I think a lot of people slept on this release they didn't care for it too much guys this is a sleeper jordan one but a jordan one that you should not hold sell them sell them sell them and move on to the next release can't go wrong with the colorway they're very wearable which is nice and quality is nice you know it's a very soft leather they did a really nice job with the sneaker it's just not a good investment be sure to let them go if you're holding on to pairs and you're looking to invest not a good Jordan 1 investment at all. Let them go. Take your money. Put it into maybe some Shadow 2.0s. Maybe some Royal Toes. Maybe University Blue Jordan 1s. There's other Jordan 1s that I've recently released that you can go ahead and put your money into. Be sure to like this video. Be sure to subscribe. Join the giveaway for the Shadow Air Jordan 1 2.0. Brand new size 9.5. I'm picking the winner tomorrow. So be sure to get your giveaway entries in. Like, subscribe. Comment down below, follow me on Instagram, DM me proof, and that is your giveaway entry. Go invest in these, buy the dip while they're here, but do not, do not, do not hold the Patina Air Jordan 1. Please leave a comment down below, let me know if you agree or you disagree, guys. Like I said, the Patinas will go up in price, but I definitely think it's going to take way, way too long for this Jordan 1 to go up in price where it would be worth your time, investment, and money. So be sure to quick flip the patinas, let them go, trade them, do what you gotta do. If you're looking to make money with the Jordan 1s, this is not a Jordan 1 to make a lot of money on. Get rid of them, quick flip them. I love you guys, I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up, enter in the Shadow 2.0 giveaway. Make sure you guys Join the more family, hit the subscribe button, smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out. <laughs>